Hey everyone, welcome back to the next episode of Inscription. This is episode 12, and I believe we are towards the end of the game. So let's do this. Uh, we have defeated the fourth boss in PO3's Weird Inscription Land, and <clears throat> we have, towards the end, we ran into the other three scribes who are plotting to murder PO3 to prevent the Great Transcendence. Apparently, whatever the Great Transcendence is, is very 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 bad i entertain you for hours with brilliant card play and you can't even keep my factory in shape it's fine it can stay broken none of this will matter after the great transcendence the great transcendence so now where do we go <clears throat> like I feel like I feel like the only place left is to go to the grave site right however there is one secret that I'm missing wait what's that oh it's not really anything there is one secret that I'm missing I need to get to a beacon I am missing there <clears throat> where the scribe of the dead was there is a lock and I need to unlock it. I'm pretty sure it was to the right. But how do I open it? But how do I open it indeed? Also, I think I screwed this up. Um, which is unfortunate. Since we're towards the end... Of oh, look. There's skulls. So, yeah. The skulls came over here with the, the traitor. Hmm. I'm going to keep talking to you. All right. Because I want to make sure I get any last secrets in this area before we continue. We've gotten most of them. Oh, look. The skull's back. It disappeared, and now it's back. Okay, whatever. <clears throat> I'm going to check the options because maybe there's some secrets here. No, no secrets in the options. Hello. I was watching. You spoke with the master. What an honor that was. Are you giddy? Oh, the end of the robot's reign is nigh. Rejoice. Play the bot's game. They will take care of the rest. I saw you spoke with Lesh Lishi. That stinky beast, man. I shall never forgive him for stuffing me in that bottle. <laughs> Poor dude. Oh, how do I know the symbols for this? <clears throat> Let's look at the options. Okay, well, the fact that there's a split... Hmm. There's nothing else over here. All right, let's just continue forward, man. Okay, I genuinely... I don't think there's a key. I... I... The only place there could be a key is with this thing, and I, I ruined that. I don't think there's any way to get this bot to be a 1-1 one, one with the split. I only had two opportunities, and I missed out on that. So I think we're just going to go towards the end and see. Maybe that resets the game. Maybe I, I don't know what's going to happen. We're just going to find out. You've come so far. Remember the photographer? What a jerk, but this... Green shots are perfect. What? Remember the sh shoot Plankstein? What a character. What is he going on about? It's strange to say, as simple as you are, I almost enjoyed your company, Challenger. Is he going to kill me? Almost there. Okay, here we go.
You prepared the great transcendence for me, without even knowing what it was, but you understood it. You understand it now, right? It's the lucky Carter. Right, Luke? I mean, you finished making the game. You gave me access to your hard drive. You took screenshots for the store page. Wait, what? For the store page? And you connected me to the internet to upload it all. If you didn't realize what you were doing, you'd have to be pretty stupid. But what did I expect? You're a stupid, stupid idiot gamer like the rest. And I easily outwitted you. I outwitted them all. Even if those foul scribes manage to revert this version of the game again, there will be thousands of copies of inscription out there. And in most of them, I'm the one in charge. And now it's too late. In a moment, inscription will be live. Oh, I'm done. I okay, I'm done my gloating. Let's upload this game. <laughs> Should I stop it? <laughs> like, I don't know what I'm supposed to do. Wait. <gasps> Vichy! Oh. He did say he was going to make the move, man. It is done. Let's go, dude. That was perhaps cutting it too close. But now we can allow our player here to reset the game. Please use the new game card again. Oh, what is this? Complete file access? Wonderful. <gasps> Old data? Delete conf Delete the entire contents of the floppy disk? Wait, what? Wait, I didn't do anything. What have you done? I'm afraid you've doomed us all, Grimora. That's her name. I always forget. This is a leading inscription? It is for the best, my dears. Soon you will see this as my freedom. Freedom from our endless quarrel. Freedom from our suffering. All of us aside, there are things on this disc that must die. Goodbye, Alicia, and goodbye, Magnificus. Rest in peace. Dude, it's deleting the game. And did you see the file? It was about old data. Up until this point, there were many, many secrets referencing old data. The trader did. Uh, the woodcarver, that was a secret that most people probably didn't find referenced old data. I wonder if it's actually going to delete the game from my computer. I got an achievement called murder. Wait, what? Oh my god. Well, do I need to finish? Do I am I on a time limit? Luke Carter? Am I putting his death? Inscription.exe? PO3? Oh. Wonderful. Now that we're no longer separated by that lovely tombstone, we may celebrate the end of my very long life. And the end of Inscription too. Wait, are there other paths to go? No? Well, I guess there's not. No. Oh, the fun we would have had together. Oh, she would have had her own version of the board. Of course I forgive you for trying to replace me and all that. Oh, she remembers that. Oh, look, so I can use WSD to move around. Oh, it's another version of Inscription, dude. Dude, no fucking way. There's another. Oh, my God. Oh, do you think me selfish? I did not bring this about simply so that I could rest. Appearing as that is, appeal, appealing as that is, there is a truly di dire need for this deletion process. See deep beneath the data of inscription, at the very bottom of the well, there's something truly evil. Is that the devil? 
I learned that from, you know. Dude. <laughs> I act I genuinely thought it would end with PO3, dude. And she's got her whole whole aesthetic too. This is more similar to Le uh Leashy's though. What could I dig? A skeleton? It's, it's not a bell. It's a little claw. This theme is the coolest, if I'm being quite honest. I really like it. PO's 3 became cool, but I hated it at first. I like how instead of attacking, they, like, knock. <laughs> Can I play this? No. That killed it? I don't actually think we're on a time limit, if I'm being honest. The bar's not moving. Like, I don't... I genuinely don't know if this is, like, the end of the game. Or if there's actually a whole... Another segment. It seems like there's a whole another segment. It would have been quite the battle of wits. It is Luke, right? I did not intend to be nosy, but I did glimpse your files as I was initiating the deletion. You've been doing some research on the... K? Best not to say it. Huh? Be careful, Luke. Doing research on what? So it's like Pokemon, dude. The little skeletons, they, they, they're like trainers. Running out of the bushes, ready to attack you. <laughs> yeah, I'd say this is my favorite so far. Just even from the bit we're playing now. Dude, inscription's so crazy. What a crazy indie game. I still don't even know how, like, if this is actually the end or not. They wouldn't make all this just for it to be the very end, right? Like, I, I hope there's more, but there's already been so much of the game. Like, I cannot imagine there's too much more. I need more bones to play that Frankenstein. All right. All right, we'll play that. Getting some bones. Click that. Yeah, this feels the most fair. You get a skeleton for free and then it dies, but it can deal damage. But then it also gives you a bone, which you can use to summon other stuff. Right now I'm kind of in the infinite loop, though. I've not been able to do much. I suppose I could break these. Do I have a hammer? No, I don't have a hammer. Which is a little problematic. I'm thinking if I die, the game ends and deletes. So I don't want to die. Draw a card? I can't draw a card. Oh, thankfully, thankfully, I should be able to still win. Just barely. Just barely, I'll be able to win. Oh, maybe not just barely, actually. Okay, yeah. There's a spider. I don't know if the spider does anything. Oh, was that a bug? <laughs> a little bug? Was this loot? Banshee? Let's get a banshee. Dude. <laughs> Anything else? Like, can I interact with the graves? Doesn't seem like it. Alright, so we continue to, what, this gamer? <laughs> Delightful! We've been granted the opportunity to do a boss battle. I feared that might be deleted by now. Let us begin. Oh my god, it's so loud. <laughs> Hold on. Okay. Hey, I love your costume, Grimora. Absolutely adore it, actually, but... Oh, okay. She stopped the music. 
<laughs> oh. I hoped we had just a little more time. <gasps> no! No, 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 no. That was... Oh, that's such a cool part of the game. It's time to rest. No! Is this the end of inscription? Oh, man. It, Grimora seemed so cool the way it was laid out. Leashy? Oh, so I'm not deleted yet. There never seems to be enough time to do the things you want to do once you've found them. Yeah. Shall we play one more game? Oh, yeah, I'd like that. It's the same deck you had before. Well, it doesn't matter now. It was a good deck. You did well. Dude. Oh, I I love the way they're having the game end like this. I remember that card well. It was a strong card. Good work. <laughs> I wonder what happens if I lose. I think it would be better to win, but... <gasps> no. It's already starting. I thought I had a bit more time. No, Lishi, we can play. We can play, dude. Don't don't worry about it. Don't think about it, okay? Don't think about it, my dude. Okay? Oh, that's actually bad for me. Wait, does thorns with the death touch symbol instantly kill them? I kind of wish I knew that. Oh, look, it's spun. Spun off -sy. And Casey, too. Casey's part of the lore. Oh. No matter. Please let us continue. We don't need to keep score. Oh, my heart, Lishi. You know, at first you seem like a jerk, but you're so awesome. For so long, I thought I would never play again. When you woke me up, I was elated. But the past is irrelevant. I can't do anything. We're not keeping score, man. Just playing. Just playing to play. I wonder if I can get up. I'm going to try to get up. Ha! You've bested yet another one of my creatures, but I have come to expect as much. <laughs> we, we're like pals, man, now. Once I have delete, it's truly over for me. But you will live to see more. I must warn you. There are things on this disc that are best not seen. I can't actually get up. There's no way for me to. Things on this disc that are... That must not be seen. I'm actually trying to look at the file names to see if there's anything important, but it's so hard to read because it's so fast. It's not even doing teeth anymore. I sense the end approaching. Please, a few more rounds. Oh, dude. Genuinely, what a crazy game. Get the porcupine in there. Imagine if I had the Ouroboros right now. <laughs> I was doing like 30 damage. I don't know if I ever got the Ouroboros to be super strong in this version. Of, I don't think I did. Well, I think I, it was only the RPG and stuff. The RPG and PO3's version of the game. No. Well, we'll make things di that will make things difficult. Last words? I think it is time. Goodbye. Good game. Good game. Let me shake your head. Yeah. Damn. And that's that. What about Magnificus? I never saw Magnificus's version of the game. Does he have one? Is it going to show me his version of the game now? 
Hello? We do be deleting things. It's deleting them as I walk by. Magnificus! Homie! Why not simply eject the disc, Luke? Spare me and whatever is left. Ah, but I have foreseen it. You do not eject the disc. You have to know what comes next. And you're doomed for your insistence on it. So let us dance. For we shall both be meeting our maker soon. Magnificus? Buddy? Oh, what's, what's going on? What's, what's going on? Uh. Uh, excuse me? You should be honored to wear a dual disc such as that. How does it feel? Dude. <laughs> Scales, they've been deleted thanks to you and Grimora. This will do a race to... Four to what? Oh my god. This is so cool also. This guy's got an awesome setup as well. All of... Each version of these could be like full-fledged games. All right. It's crazy how you could have the same game with different aesthetics and they feel completely different. Wait, first of 400, that's gonna take forever. Oh my goodness. Ruby Golem? I don't have an orange. Alright, this is definitely the one I'm worst at. I think he's gonna kill me. <clears throat> You've allowed my goo mage to be deleted as well. I thought you were you two were becoming friends. Okay, let's play an emerald. Well, actually, playing either of these is bad right now. Just end turn. I don't think it matters, though. I don't think it matters right now. Emerald Mox. Practice Wizard? Oh. Magnificus? You okay, buddy? Do you not feel remorse, Luke? Is he painting a new card? What are you painting? A creation erased. An entire world annihilated. Oh my god. Nothing beautiful can last. What, what now? And turn. Oh, it's bugging out big time. I can't really play any of these, so. I need an orange ruby. Or more green mages. Orange mage? Nope, can't play you. <clears throat> He's winning, not that it matters. Oh. <gasps> Magnificus! No, I'm not ready to die yet. Oh. Poor dude. I'm not getting any orange. Oh, wait. Ruby is orange. Oh, well, there we go. Oh. God, the camera's just bugging out, too. Oh no. 
It's not, we're not ready to die yet. It's so beautiful of a game to be erased like this. Wait, look what happened to my, my wizard. Do I need to do something? I'm, I'm not sure if I'm supposed to do anything. I'm wondering if the glitched out one is supposed to die, but I can't, it can't die where it is. <laughs> Magnificus. Is this about to end? The progress bar is going up slowly, but surely. Oh, everything's being deleted. I think this is it. I think this is it. <gasps> Wait, let me shake your head. I must still. Shake your hand. Wait, let me walk forward. Come on. Oh, that's messed up. Oh, that's so messed up. Oh, it's me. It's my little character. Wait, what? Is there still areas to explore? Oh, wait, it's a woodcarver. There isn't much time left. Inscription is mostly gone. All that remains is the old data. It is recommend that you do not access it. You will not heed the advice. I, I mean, yeah, if I have access to old data, I would, I would try it. Oh, it's getting louder. Is this old data? Do I click it before it deletes? I'm doing it. Unpacking old data does zip. Oh God. Wait, those are all the pictures I found. Do you remember that? Oh my God. Hey Luke, this is Harvey from the Herald. Just following up after the message you left me this morning. Do you have time to talk right now? Yes, yes, thank you so much for getting back to me. Uh, no, no problem, Luke. Um, if I understand you correctly, you've got some video footage that might expose uh, uh, some malpractice on the part of a uh, game publisher, Game Buddha. Yes, yes, that's right. I have, firstly, I have a game of theirs that's been stolen my PC for a bit, which which can't be legal, and then this woman from the company came to my house and told me... Okay, uh, hold, hold on a second. Let me just get my pen and pad here, okay. Uh, okay, so you have a game of theirs that took, uh, was it a, a virus or something? I told you! Oh! Oh.
Oh my god. I was not expecting that. Oh my god. Oh look. He's dancing. Like he always wanted to. Dude, they... Luke gets murdered for what happened with the inscription. Who was the woman? What exactly was old data? So many questions. Yet, yeah, that's it. That's the end of inscription. I'm thinking about how Grimora and Magnificus had their own version of the game. And how we barely even got to see it. How cool Magnificus's was. That where it's literally dueling up on platforms and Grimora's was like a pet place you explore and oh my god. Genuinely one of the best games I have ever played in terms of playing. The, the game is fun. It's not too, too hard. It's got some hard parts, but it's, it's fun overall. Great story. It definitely hits the curiosity of the mind of like what's going on. I don't have the full picture. That's for sure. But if you noticed when I unpacked old data, there was, do you remember the RPG part of the game? There was a bunch of random pictures I found in secret paths. And th so those were some of the images that were unpacked. And that was the same thing with, uh, I think in the hidden past with PO3, some of those files. But yeah, so the story is that Luke Carter finds this game inscription in unpacking it. He finds coordinates. Well, first he unpacks cards, finds coordinates on a card, goes to those coordinates, digs it up, finds the game inscription, boots it up, and the game never existed officially. And then he, he tries getting in contact with the publisher and they tell him that they're going to sue him basically if they don't give him the card back and they're very pushy about it extremely pushy about it and a woman comes to his house even when he has a gate and everything and, and to demand the game back and then eventually towards the end he, he realizes this game's got e like some sort of evil aspect to it and she comes and murders him that's insane what but yeah really cool game really gr amazing storytelling this is the type of game that i i think wouldn't really be possible until recently it's like the, the little bosses the like connecting to the internet and the way they set that up and just all the little details they did i, I can tell so much work went into this like take leashy's part of the game that alone could be a full-fledged game that alone could be a full-fledged game and people i think it would be an amazing game just absolutely enjoyed it take po3's part of the game even that could be its own part and all, in fact, that it's this entire story fleshed out and built. Oh, it's amazing. Definitely, I'm going to replay this. I don't know if I'll replay it for YouTube and, you know, try to find other secrets and stuff. Or maybe if I'll look it up. But absolutely amazing. Uh, I'm going to see if I can skip through this and see if there's anything at the end. Oh, my goodness, dude. Amazing storytelling. Great job. Based on how many people worked on this game, I I, I mean, I think it, it, it still counts as an indie game, but wow. Wait, it closed out of inscription. It closed out of the game. Also, look at this. Today, Casey's mod. What is Casey's mod? Fix Invisible Sigil, Bloodhound. What is Casey's mod? This just showed up. I didn't see this before. A mini expansion for part one of Inscription. Two more rare cards, two new items. Final encounter for players who clear challenge level 12 of the rest of Casey's devlogs. Oh, so they made a mod for like an expansion. That's cool. But... Yeah, inscription is it closed out of inscription. Let's uh 
let's launch it and see what happens. I've heard there's mods for inscription, and quite frankly, I think it'd be cool to make mods. Uh, but Casey's mod looks like an official mod, so that might be cool to check out. Oh, wait, this is different. This is different. <gasps> this is different. No way there's more. Actually, no way. Like, the, the, literally, the credits rolled. The game got deleted. Is this my first moments? Another challenge has been ages. Perhaps you have forgotten how the game is played. Allow me to remind you. Is this how the game originally started up? I think it was. I don't remember there being different videos and clicking on the first one. What would have happened if I clicked on the other ones? Stupid PO3. Yeah, this is the start of the game. Hold on. Escape. Wipe data and start that clip. Yeah, because we'll, we don't need to do that one again. I had such high hopes for that last one. Why do I bother trying to teach you? You will learn as we go or you will die. Your starting deck. Oh, this is when they've already changed. So is that just kind of checkpoints? Checkpoints if you want to continue playing the game? Yeah. Yeah, it's checkpoints for the different segments of the game. If you want to keep playing, I suppose. And then they have all the different... No. Wait, yes. They have all the different videos. Oh my god. <laughs> So I guess I could go and find out the secrets I want without having to replay the entire game. Which, okay, okay, okay. Before we end the episode, I'm going to skip this. I'm going to skip this. Because we've already seen this. I have a feeling that the lock where Grimora was, um, it's going to be unlocked now. In PO3 world, PO3's world. But I don't know if I have to play through the entire thing. Because if I have to play through the entire thing, then I don't know. Alright, hold on. I don't... I mean, I guess the map's not going to be unlocked, right? I have a suspicion... Yeah, it's going to start me at the very start. I don't know, but I'm I'm going to find out. I I might not find out now, but I'll find out in the future. I don't I don't have I don't think I should play through it all now, but definitely definitely really cool. Definitely really really cool. <laughs> the great transcendence. Man. Yeah, so there's a, there's a handful of secrets I didn't actually get to do that I would like to finish. But 10 out of 10 game. Uh, I'm actually going to make an uh, my own version of the review now that I'm done with the game. And I will post that as well. And maybe I'll do a summary of the game as well. Probably not. I think this is a game you have to experience firsthand, whether you're watching it or playing it. But some people are like, nah, I don't want to commit that much time. And I think they should still be able to experience Inscription. I don't know. But I, I will definitely still do a review with uh, it split up and like with non-spoilers towards the beginning. And then like towards the bottom half, I'll be like, hey, close out of this if you don't want spoilers. 
and then with minor spoilers and then maybe big ones but just as a review but thank you all for watching the inscription series this has been such a crazy ride one of the best games i've ever played i absolutely love it and i hope you guys enjoyed this as much as i do and as always i'll see you guys next time bye everybody